Hmm. It's getting blurry now that it's so close. But not a problem for science. Jojo Science Show! Hello, welcome to Jojo Science Show. <laughs> Today, I'm going to teach you how to improve your eyes focus up close with one simple trick. All you'll need for this experiment is a little card or piece of paper. Attack and finally a phone. Make sure an adult is supervising you while you're using tacks because tacks are sharp. You can also try this with your finger like this. This is an experiment you can probably do right now on your own. You can try this trick on your friends and family. They'll be amazed. Get something with words on the screen. Now hold the phone so close to your eyes that your eyes can't focus on the screen so that the words look really blurry. Hmm, now I can't see it. Make a pinhole with your finger like this, then close one eye with the other eye looking through it, and then look at the phone. I can see him clearly now. You can adjust the size of the hole that you make with your finger to improve your vision even more. You can use this trick to help you focus on things up close. You can also do this experiment with a piece of thin cardboard and a thumbtack. Poke a hole in the cardboard with your thumbtack like this. And make sure you don't poke yourself while you're doing this. And there's your pinhole. Now, just make sure you can get it out. Now look through it and make sure you have a pinhole. Yep, I can slightly see you. Now, I'm going to try to read up close again with this pinhole. Hey, I can see it. Now it's not blurry anymore. Pinhole glasses. I'm reading the Wikipedia article on pinhole glasses. Pinhole glasses also known as stenopeic glasses. We wanted to see if this would work even with our camera. We fixed our focus so the words would be blurry and then we placed the pinhole in front of the lens. Oh wow, it works with the camera. Look how much clearer it is with the pinhole. This works because the lenses in your eyes try to bend the light that's coming in. But when something is too close, your lens can't bend it enough. But with the pinhole, it focuses the light right onto your retina. The retina is the back of your eye. And that's where the image is typically formed. Before it passes on to your optic nerve. And then to your brain. So your eyes have the lenses and the retina. So the lenses bend the light onto the retina and causes it to focus at a point. When your lenses can't bend the light properly onto a single point, it looks blurry. The pinhole only allows a small beam of light, and that beam of light goes straight to the center of your eye, so your lenses don't have to bend the light very much at all. But with this trick, the pinhole focuses the light for you, so your lenses don't have to bend it much. This is why some people see better when they squint. Hmm. I can see you. Thanks for watching JoJo Science Show. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button down below and subscribe to my channel so you can become a kid scientist too. And ring the bell so you'll receive notifications whenever I post a new fun video. And remember kids, science is fun! And smash that like button down below.